Ahlan. What comes to your mind when you think of Syria? In my opinion, it's the land of living history. With a rich history, Syria has always been home to diverse cultures, ethnicities, and religions. Unfortunately, due to civil war, many Syrians nowadays have been forced to flee their homes since 2011, seeking safety as refugees in other countries. Nonetheless, in the eyes of the world, it's still the land of beautiful roses. Cherished by Shakespeare, most of the roses go into making the most significant culinary product in the region, rose water. In order to better understand Syria, known as one of the most ancient inhabited regions on earth, I'll divide my presentation into five parts. Land of Syria, culture of Syria, the attractions of Syria, the food of Syria, and the sports of Syria. First of all, let's start with the land of Syria. Syria, officially the Syrian Arab Republic, is located on the east coast of the Mediterranean Sea in Western Asia. It's bordered by Turkey, Lebanon, Israel, Jordan, and Iraq, and it shares maritime borders with Cyprus. Syria consists of mountain ranges in the west, with a short, narrow coastal plain along the Mediterranean, and a steep area inland. In the east lies the Syrian desert, and in the south is the Jabal Adruz Range. The country has two major regions, western and eastern regions, which are separated by the Great Rift Valley. Among them, one third of the land is arable, and one third is pasturable. With an area of over 185,000 kilometers squared, including the territory in the Golan Heights, Syria's size is similar to that of Hubei Province in China. Mount Hermon is the highest mountain, and the Euphrates River is the longest river in the nation. The current population is estimated at 17.8 million people. Damascus is the capital, and other major cities are Aleppo. Hims, Hama, and Latakia. Syria is divided into 14 provinces, which are subdivided into 61 districts. The national flag consists of three colors: red, white, and black, with two green stars on the white stripe. Syrian currency is called the pound, and the current exchange rate for one Chinese yuan is over 190 Syrian pounds. The climate in the Mediterranean region has mild rainy winters and hot summers, while its subtropical inland areas have moderately cold winters and scorching summers. Second, let's take a look at the culture of Syria. It is estimated that 87% of Syrians are Muslim. The majority being Sunni Muslims, Arabic is the official language of the country, although a large number of Syrians can speak English, French, or Russian. Syria has a rich religious and cultural history rooted in Islam. They have their own religious beliefs, social stratification, rules of etiquette, and cultural taboos. Let's take a look at the big no-nos. Here are five things you should avoid doing while traveling in Syria. Number one, females. Don't ask questions to Syrian female members of family. It's inappropriate to do that. However, it's fine to ask about their health. Number two, greetings. Don't just say hello to individuals when entering a Syrian home. Make sure to greet everyone in the house with a warm smile. Number three, politics. Don't talk about Syrian politics unless the person you're talking to initiates the conversation about it, because it's a sensitive topic in Syria. Number four, sitting. Don't sit down immediately unless offered a specific seat. It's more likely that your Syrian hosts will assign you a seat. Number five, tea. Don't finish your tea in one gulp. When drinking tea or coffee. It's always better to drink slowly to spend time with your host. Third, let's talk about the attractions of Syria.
There's a saying in Arabic, if heaven is on earth, then Damascus must be it. If heaven is in the sky, then Damascus must be the same as it. Taking this into consideration, the top attractions to visit in the capital of Damascus are Umayyad Grand Mosque, a famous landmark in Damascus. Al-Azam Palace is a folk museum with beautiful Persian architecture. Damascus' old city is a beautiful ancient city known as the City in Heaven. The Damascus National Museum, established in 1919, is the largest museum in Syria. Bab Sharki, also known as the Gate of the Sun, is one of the seven ancient city gates of Damascus in Syria. And Mount Kassian, a mountain overlooking the city of Damascus. The attractions outside the capital are St. Simon Citadel, which is one of the oldest surviving church complexes. Palmyra, one of the greatest cities in the ancient world, is the most famous attractions in Syria. The Aleppo Citadel, a huge medieval fortified palace built on a 50-meter mound. Krak de Chevalier is an imposing former crusader castle in the city of Hims. The Basra Amphitheater is the main historical symbol of the Syrian city of Basra, which was built in the 2nd century AD. Mount Hermon Ski Resort in the Israeli-occupied portion of the Golden Heights. Fourth, let's move on to the food of Syria. Wheat is the main crop and considered a staple food in Syria. Vegetables, fruits, and dairy products are quite common in Syrian cuisine. It is worth noting that the main dishes that form Syrian cuisine are kabeh, the national dishes, is a raw dish made from a mixture of bulgur, very finely minced lamb, or beef. Hummus, a delicious spread or dip made from chickpeas. Tahini, lemon, and spices. Tabuleh, a traditional Syrian salad prepared with flat parsley, onion, tomato, and mint. Fatouche, a common mess or appetizer. Labne is a delicious Middle Eastern soft, fresh cheese that can be eaten for breakfast. Shawarma is basically a sandwich wrap fast food or a side dish in Syrian culture. Jadara has its high nutritional value and is also a vegetarian dish. Shanklish is a blue cheese made from sheep's or cow's milk. Bastirma is a spicy air-dried beef eaten in Syria, mainly as part of a mez spread. And kebab halabi is a kind of grilled meat served with a spicy tomato sauce and Aleppo pepper. Last but not least, let's move on to the sports of Syria. There is no doubt that football is the most popular sport in Syria, and Syrians closely follow both Arab and European football matches broadcasted on national television. In addition to football, other popular national sports in Syria are basketball, swimming, and tennis. Beyond that, weightlifting, judo, and karate are popular in the cities, and health clubs and gyms are also becoming increasingly common in the capital. Syria first competed in the Asian Games in 1978, and has done so 10 times from the 8th Asian Games in Bangkok to the 18th in Jakarta. In those 10 games, Syrian athletes won a total of 31 medals, with 9 gold medals in boxing, freestyle, karate, swimming, and weightlifting. Okay, I've only given you a brief introduction to Syria, known as the home to one of the oldest civilizations in the world. However, since the 10-year-long civil war is still an ongoing issue in Syria, you'd better plan your travel with a local guide for now. Thanks a lot for watching. If you really like this video, please continue to watch the following units. Have a good day. Ma Goodbye, everyone.